you go back to slavery. Yeah. I saw this. I saw schools working. Any government that is not ready to go back to making education of our people a priority is not the next president. Welcome you back to Lajubong Wash TV. I don't have bad news for you today. What is happening in the Christian world? Join now to make sense of life. So you pray for the name that is Peter will be is now popular everywhere, but pray for him. If you trust in the voice of men, it will still not happen. Nothing will happen. Because I've designed his spirit. God brought him to me in the night. And I see so much so much confidence in men rather than confidence in God so when the Lord designed when, when I designed him I, I found myself stop a car at the bus stop see this is how these things work some of you don't understand let me be give you some of the process I was standing at the bus stop and I stopped a car and he was the driver and I entered the back at the driver's and the owner's seat and there was another man at the back and there was a lady in front with bandage on her leg and we were driving on Lecky Road coming from this tower what they call the tower civic tower and then we we're arguing about two things he was telling me about the importance of voting and sure you vote i said yes all christians everybody must vote i said but you must pray and that was the argument we were having in the car and then he stopped me under the bridge now coming from civic tower huh huh that's what they call the road he stopped me under the bridge and made a u-turn huh made a u-turn and then let me leave the remaining part so what is this so why will i be in a car and this man is driving this lady in front with a leg that is bandaged raised up like this and there's a man at the back and i'm talking when we are all discussing and they dropped me there and then i find myself opposite me was a theater and there was about to be a prayer for nigeria going on there and then ahead of me was an invitation to speak somewhere let me leave that part pray for the man pray pray go ahead and pray this is internal problem you hear what i said internal problem what so you are looking at a situation where people that should be in the, on the same side start dividing themselves this is internal problem pray for the party i think it's called labor right pray for the party pray for the easterners when all this is we unfold you remember i told you but we have to pray prayer can change everything but things may not flow the way people are thinking but if there is prayer if there's dependency on god god has promised us what you will walk see i work with a god that is not a talkative he's a master do you understand so jesus does not know the day he's coming again jesus said i'm coming again right does he know the date do you know the date even the jesus the son of god does not know the date he said the day and the hour knoweth no man including the son of man the father has kept that in his power for you to understand how god is the problem we don't know god imagine god can keep a secret and not tell his son the one he said this is my beloved son that sits at his right hand does not know the dates there are some things he keeps like that when he keeps it don't go and be talking what he has not talked so you say only what he has said you keep quiet about what he has not said i have not spoken look at that look at it read everybody read so you don't prophesy when god has not spoken you don't speak based on pressure you don't speak newspaper popular opinion you don't speak what is going on online you don't copy information to prophesy you hear from god that's what is called the integrity of a prophet people tell me prophesy i say i don't see anything please tell me what god is saying i did not hear what do you want me to do should i keep myself should i forge prophecy for you no only what i hear i speak as i hear i speak that's what jesus said 
As I hear, I speak. I only prophesy what I have heard. So so far, this is where we are. This is a very delicate journey. We must keep backing it up with what? Prayer. The symbolism and the significance of this is that this nation cannot go down. Nigeria cannot go down. We are going to blast the Jericho blast. The Sami Snat will take the lead and they will do that up to seven times. And so, when I do the blast, you take the lead, and then they will respond. They will respond. So I think we'll take the two notes. And so, do, 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 long, long, blast, long. Wait, now, when you hear the first one, you shout the loudest, hallelujah. When you hear the second one, when you hear the third one, by the seventh one, Clap, shout, leap. Go, one. Hey! Two. Flags together, Archbishop. Please put her. Yes, put it all together, Father. In the name of Jesus, we are here on our knees to surrender and lift up Nigeria. Thank you for a new day. Just open your mouth and say something concerning Nigeria. Everybody, 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 everybody. say something.
Nigeria cannot go down. The agenda of hell cannot succeed for Nigeria. In Jesus' precious name. Those representing our political leadership, just one word of declaration over the nation from this altar. As a leader in this nation, it is well with Nigeria. Nigeria is blessed. Nigeria, you are not going. Whatever it is, just sharply, starting with. It is well with Nigeria. Let me say that Nigeria will never go down. Amen. A new dawn is better Amen. in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Only the Lord will do this in Jesus' name. Amen. Father, we all join our faith together and declare henceforth Nigeria is liberated. Nigeria is rescued. Amen. Nigeria is restored. Amen. To the glory of you, God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. God, we have no other country except this one. God deliver us. God free us. God liberate us. We have no other nation except this one. God deliver us. Amen.